When it comes to feeding tortoises, commercial diets can add a very crucial role into incorporating in their lives. A lot of people will recommend it, including myself. Um, obviously, you want to have a varied diet within all your tortoises and even with their all reptiles in their life cycles. However, commercial diets can be very difficult for some tortoises to get used to. So today I am going to go over what I do to get my tortoises to eat all their commercial food. Stay tuned. Now, when it comes to any diet for tortoise, as I mentioned, you want to have variation. A lot of tortoises in the wild eat weeds, grasses, broadleaf leaves, vegetation such as that. A lot of people, we have that in our very own backyards, which is great. Um, but we also like to incorporate store-bought greens into that and as well as commercial diets. Now, the reason for adding commercial diets is because they may add some certain nutrients that the animals may find in their natural habitat. They have extra vitamins, any other thing that could help them thrive. Uh, there's many different types of commercial diets on the market. One of my personal favorites is the newer one, which is the Arcadia Tortoise Optimized. Um, there is also Missouri Tortoise Diet, which I have above right here. Uh, there's a Zoo Med Diet, Flukers, there's many different brands of it, but they all essentially have the same aspect in it and they all give additional nutrients to these animals. Now when it comes to feeding commercial diets to some of these animals, you might have some difficulty trying to get them hooked on it. Now, I don't feed commercial diets all the time. I mostly will give weeds, wildflowers, grasses, stuff like that to my different species of horses. However, I do like to incorporate a commercial diet about once a week that way, uh, and it's typically on Wednesday, that way they can get these additional nutrients and extra supplies and stuff that these different companies provide. Now, when I first tried to get a commercial diet to all my animals, actually some of them took to it very well. However, one species that I own in particular will not touch any commercial diet. Now this may vary with different people, different animals will like different things. All of my tortoises, other than my one species that I own, goes crazy for commercial diet. They love Missouri, they love the Arcadia, but my African pancake tortoises are the one species that will not touch either. So here is what I do to help incorporate this commercial diet and these extra benefits and nutrients into their lives. And the way I accomplish this is just by mixing a commercial diet. So for today, I'm gonna to be using the Arcadia optimized tortoise food. And I'm gonna be mixing it with a little bit of romaine. So here's the steps of how I do this. First, I'll be adding the Arcadia into a bowl and getting it nice and wet. Decent amount. I'm gonna be feeding this mixture to all of my tortoises today. So I'm gonna be doing quite a bit. Now we're gonna let this sit for a couple minutes. And while that's sitting, we're gonna go ahead and chop up some romaine lettuce here. All right, so we have two heads of romaine lettuce here. And I like to do this just with any type of green that all my animals enjoy open, or eating. All my animals will love romaine lettuce. Obviously, I don't give this to them every day. It's variation that is most important, as I mentioned before. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and just chop it up pretty finely. And then the final step will be adding it into a blender. So the idea is, is I will be blending it all up into almost like a little bit of a slushy. And what this will do is it'll basically hide the unappealingness of any of the non-commercial products and it'll entice them to eat everything and they get a mix of everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix this all up and add it into my blender here. All right, now that I got my mix all set up, I'm gonna do it a little bit, a couple portions at a time, but I'm just gonna go ahead, stick it in my blender and blend it till I get the desired consistency that I want. Now if you notice here, it is not blending up, so what I'm going to do is just simply add a little bit of water to that. Alright, so as you can see here, I have this basically just pasty looking supplement. Now what I'm going to do is, I added too little too much water in this one, so I'm just going to add that to here. And that should help even it out because I don't want it to be too much of a slurry in the case that, you know, the tortoises make the mess, which they are notorious for doing. But after that, we just go ahead and mix this final bit together and we have a nice mix of everything that the tortoises will like. All right, now that that is completed, all that's left to do is to go ahead and give this to the animals. We'll go ahead and give this to all my animals and we'll see which ones take a liking to it.
All right, so as you can see here, my leopard tortoise is just chowing down on it. He loves it. He's never been really picky when it comes to commercial diets, but still, I like to get a little mixture in there. So it looks like just one of our pancakes has found it. it looks like we got another one coming out. Now they're gonna run away because I'm over here, but she was just devouring it. All right, and as you can see, this is one of my male pancake tortoises. He is just going to town on this. Now, obviously all the other tortoises are probably out and about hiding right now, but they will come over to it as well. And the main takeaway from this is that you kind of have to situate tortoises like kids. Um, they're, you're gonna have picky ones, you're gonna have feisty ones, but the idea is you can trick them just like you do with kids. And at the end of the day, once you get that done, you'll get them to eat their food, so. All right, well, I hope you guys all learned something from this video. Um, many of the commercial product people, such as Missouri, Arcadia, the Zoomags, they will have different recommendations of how to get this to your tortoise, and it's basically the same thing. Many people have already done videos about this as well, but I kind of like to show that I like to do it too, and it does actually work. Now they're getting all the beneficial nutrients, all those extra food items that they could be getting, and it helps out everybody all around. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video.